हेलो फ्रेंड्स वंस अगेन वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल टेक्नेट गाइड फ्रेंड्स इन दिस वीडियो वी विल लर्न लुक फोर जे पैच इंस्टॉलेशन इन सिस्को आइस एज वी नो दैट लुक फोर जे वर्नेबिलिटी हिट ऑन द डिवाइस सो नाउ सिस्को हैज रिलीज्ड पैच टू रिमूव वर्नेबिलिटी फ्रॉम सिस्को आइस सो यू कैन सी माई करेंट वर्जन इज टू so i have to install log 4j patch on my device to remove vulnerability to keep safe my device so friends let me show you what step we will follow for log 4j patch patch installation so friends our first step will be download the below patch from the cisco portal so you can see we we will download i apply this patch from cisco site portal and second patch will download rollback patch in case any issue then we can roll back okay we have to download these two okay now second step will be we will create a repository to copy downloaded file to repository and install okay now third step will after create repository you can install patch from cli okay so first we will download this two file two patch file so go to cisco site let me go to cisco portal download portal okay now type here identity now type here i identity service engine software click here now click on browse now you can see we have a uh, this log patch to fix log from 3.1 okay so my work current version is 2.7 so i have to download this log here this one okay log 4j fix 2.24 to 3.0 so i have to download these two file first file and second file it is patch file here so we have to download this okay and second one is a rollback in case any issue then we can roll back this now click here to download accept save now click here to download both file okay it's a zero mb file you can see okay after download so friends after download you have to keep this file in ftp folder ftp repository folder so let me show you let me show you i have downloaded this both file patch file and second one is rollback file okay so now second step we have to create a repository here to copy patch file to local disk now create go to administration and click here maintenance now select repository now we have to click on add now click here uh, like upgrade repository upgrade repo now friends select here ftp to copy from ftp provide here ftp ip address make sure your ftp server should be reachable from your eyes okay my ftp server ip address make sure this ftp server should be reachable from your eyes now select provide path here now provide ftp server user id and password cisco123 submit update now we have to validate check okay now successfully validated okay now now friends we have completed step 1 and step 2 created repository okay now in third step we will install patch okay so let's log in on cli now friends we have login on my cli so one thing 
before going to upgrade let me tell you it will restart your services i services okay so it will take approx 10 to 15 minutes to upgrade okay install during the installation your services your i services will be restart okay so you have to install this patch in maintenance window okay so let me show you here so now let's check here so repository repository name upgrade press repo okay so here it's showing my both file here installation file patch installation file and second is rollback file okay so now i'm going to install it so you can see we have both file here patch installation file and rollback file here okay so now we have to install it application install now we have to select this file copy copy here name then we have to type here repository name okay now press enter now type yes to start installation okay successful remove vulnerable class from log j core the starting application here okay it will take approx 10 to 15 minutes it's a restarting application after restart successfully installed we will check verify it's successfully installed or not now friends you can see hot patch applied successfully okay application successfully installed here okay so now check ice services show application status ice so now you can see it's initializing here okay application status initializing once done you can so now you can see ice application server is running running state now we can verify our patch installation successfully installed or not so you have to run this command here to verify our patch successfully installed or not so, so we have to run this command so logging application hot patch hot patch dot log okay you have to run this command to verify our installation patch installation press enter here so now you can see it's showing result here all common means your patch is successfully installed on date 26 jan okay time here so now friends if you want to roll back this patch so what we have to do just go to again repo so repository upgrade dash repo so now we have to run this command application install this one okay you have to run this one after running this you can roll back okay your patch installation so now everything fine for me so i'm not going to roll back so friends in this video you have seen how to install log4j patch on your cisco ice device to remove vulnerability okay so thanks for watching this video have a nice day